This week on Weasel News. Good evening, Los Santos. Travis Rashgard here in tonight's top story. Say hello to your new mayor, Osvaldo Pingafria of the Cuban National Party. Osvaldo is the highest ranking member of an elite task force known as the Federales. His fame and diverse network of connections throughout our fair city have quickly given him a well-deserved, and some might say meteoric rise, to power. But with great power comes great responsibility. Are Mr. Pingafria and his Cuban cohorts even ready for the trials and tribulations of public office? Find out next after a quick word from this week's sponsor, Benson's Back Alley Motors. Hey, I'm Barry Benson from Benson's Back Alley Motors. And today we're selling unique and rare vehicles right in the heart of Vespucci. Uh, where the, our prices are so low, uh, you'll you'll think it's a scam, but it's not a scam. We sell actual vehicles like like these ones. Oh my God, is that famous uh, pop star Britney Spears here to purchase a vehicle? It's Britney, bitch. Wow. Oh my God, so many famous artists shop down here at Benson's Back Alley Motors. Uh, what's that? You're being assaulted. Don't ignore that. Don't get oh, that on oh, camera. Ah. Back to me. There's another one. Okay, just uh, shop at Benson's uh, Back Alley Motors today and pick yourself up your own uh, vehicle today. Benson's and Back play, yeah, play Alley jingle. Motors. We do our business in the Back <laughs> Alley. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Benson's Back Alley Motors is not responsible for any injury, death, or dismemberment due to the unsafe use of the vehicles. BBM does not endorse any crime committed in the vehicles sold by BBM, but if you shoot cops, that's great. Fuck the dogs. Benson's Back Alley Motors is a registered trademark of the BBM company. Any likeness used, we will hunt you down. All sales are final. Fuck off. Welcome back, Los Santos. We first encountered Mr. Prigafria while undercover in Los Santos' own third world dystopian hellscape. Word was spreading of a secret underground ring of disgruntled Disney cosplayers in Little Soul some of which alleged police officers. Los Santos, I must warn you that the footage you're about to see may shock you and viewer discretion is advised. We're gonna have everybody single file line right here. You know, right there, right near the stage for me, please. What you're gonna do is you're gonna at least do like a little line, you know, to try to convince us. There's a snake in my ass. Excuse um, me. I I could always get someone else to watch the sheep tonight if you know what I mean. You know, you know, Boy, what the f- what? Oh, yeah, hey, Disney's a kids' yeah. movies. What is wrong with you? Woo! You are hey, disqualified, boobos. You are disqualified. Next. Because we were like, whoa. And I was like, whoa. And you were like, whoa. Captain America. Yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh. Wait, Megan. Oh, my God. No. Wait, who has a gun? Are you flipping me off right now, motherfucker? <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? Wait, 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 I don't like your okay. shoes either. What the fuck? Okay, you disqualify me. Get the fuck out of here. What the fuck? What the fuck? All right. After the end, when they decided the to the their energy, they get the die. fuck off of there, bro. Get the fuck off the stage. I'm Army Hammer's character, the Lone Ranger from the 2013 Ooh. Disney film, The Lone Ranger, starring Army Hammer. That guy's a cannibal. Get off the stage. Uh, there is a snake in my boot. Wow. I'm about to reenact a scene from Toy oh. Story. Of Andy's coming. Should have ended. Yeah. I said Disney characters, not Moose Beard. I am. I am Jack Sparrow. Wait, 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 wait. I, I think we're disqualified. He's disqualified. He's disqualified. He's disqualified. He's disqualified. You know, I should have went to this bullshit ass thing. Hey, listen, anyway, listen here, buddy. What? You are appropriating.
Ladies and gentlemen, Weasel News would like to apologize for any emotional trauma caused by the last segment. It was here, though, at Maldini's, deep undercover within the CD under bowels of Los Santos, that I discovered a group of individuals potentially powerful enough to contain madness such as this. I'm referring, of course, to the Cuban Federales. A quick lunch with these boys and three truly horrifying trips to the emergency room later, and we were ready to get to work. We made our way to the Los Santos Town Hall for our first formal promotion, where Weasel News' own lead reporter Tommy Tinker gave our new commander-in-chief a few tips on how to address the public. I believe the results will speak for themselves. Hello, my name is Osvaldo and I'm running for mayor. And I have big, fun, exciting things happening in this city if I'm elected mayor. I'm going to make everything better for the people, for everybody. When, when I'm elected, don't say if, when. You want to put that Shit. mindset of that you are. Don't shush me, bitch. Hello, my name is Osvaldo Pinga Fria, and I'm running for mayor. I'm going to make things more exciting, better, and bigger than ever before in this city. When I'm mayor, you're going to have the time of your life here, and you're going to f***ing enjoy being in this city. You better f***ing vote for... No, wait, no, no, no. Vote for me, your next mayor. Can I, can I say something real quick? All right, you're looking at the camera. And just, this is hypotheticals, right? I'm Tommy Tinker, I'm running for mayor. I see what's going on in this city. I see and understand how you feel. I can feel the energy that is coming off of you and you are not happy. And I'm changing that starting right now. When I am mayor, big, new, fresh changes to this city. Things that are important to you. Lifestyles, living situations, pays, taxes, gas prices. I'm changing for you. Okay. So All right, you for just me. Change everything. Literally, we're going to change literally everything. everything. You just changed it. <laughs> you literally changed. Was, we're moving no, no, to Kale no. Perico. Big, big words. Can big you delete? Words. Can yeah. you delete that footage? By the way, delete no. any footage no, that has. I'm not gonna do that. With our senses honed and our tongues sharpened, we were ready to hit the streets and gather support by kissing hands and shaking babies. As you will see, the sentiment was all but unanimous that Osvaldo Pingafria is the only candidate that you can trust in this upcoming election. Hello, my name is Damian Tinkerman, multiple platinum recording artist, all-around successful goth business owner. I hereby endorse Osvaldo for mayor. Uh, viva Cuba. Would it surprise you if I told you he was running for mayor? Uh, oh, I think I knew that. Do you support him? Depends on the candidates, you know, I don't know all the candidates. Nobody else is running. Nobody? Nobody. Well then, I guess, I guess he's gonna be mayor. Do you support that? Yeah. <laughs> my, my vote is for Osvaldo Coma Pinga. What the f- Coma for you, Pinga. All right, my name's Mac Lando, and Osvaldo's got my vote. Vote for Osvaldo that gives me that. Oje, 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 oje. Osvaldo ping friend the alarm. That's it. You got it. My name is Don Dolph, and I want everyone out there to vote for Osvaldo Pinga Fria, because I will be too. And you're telling me there weren't more companies out there creating energy for that world? It was one company, and then one guy changed it completely? Uh-uh. I don't, I don't buy it. I don't believe it. Mr. Osvaldo? He's a pretty nice guy, and uh, the Cubans, uh, they did a Cuban cash cow, and that was a lot of fun. Uh, fuck off some of my roads, but do you know who you shouldn't fuck? The Federalis, because they are very nice people. Uh, um, to, uh, whenever I meet them around the city, you know, they always smile, they always say how I'm doing, see if I need anything. I think it's amazing uh, how long they lived for. How long they lived for? I mean, how long they're still, like, it's amazing how they're still alive, I guess. Yeah, they're very powerful. Osvaldo's persistent, determined, and one of my favorite jackasses. Hell yeah. I think he'd be a good mayor if he was uh, supervised. I want to say, Osvaldo's always been kind to me, you know what I'm saying? He bought me this tractor right here, 1.5 million. He's helped me through thick and thin. I got out of prison, I had nowhere to go. He bought me a house. And there I was on the streets being helped when out of nowhere, the man in shining armor, they call us Baldo, saved my life. 
Here at Weasel News, we pride ourselves in being able to sniff out the most talented, powerful, and noteworthy leaders. Some call it intuition, others a sixth sense. Some have even claimed that our deductive prowess is downright unnatural. But by tapping into that bottomless pool of insight, we've decided to begin our journey along the campaign trail by meeting with one of the most infamous and powerful business organizations in town, Girardi Incorporated. I got this. I got it, boy. I got you. I got you, bro. He attacked me! Uh, no. He's not, what happened here, Chatterbox? Tell us what happened. Tell us. He hit me off my bike and he oh got Oh, my out. God. Ladies and gentlemen, you in here first. Sergeant Cannolius knocked him off his motorcycle and then Sir, attacked him and kicked him in the, the face. Roof of uh, Sergeant Cannolius, do you have bicycle. anything to say about up. these allegations <laughs> uh, no comment. against you? He has no comment, ladies and gentlemen. A police officer. What the fuck? <laughs> Wait, 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 say that into the camera. Promise that to the camera, to the people of this city, Osvaldo. I promise say I like that car. I do promise, promise it, Osvaldo. I, I guarantee that. that I will get that fun house for Chaturbu and the clowns. All right, you got my vote. And the clowns. And the clowns. Get the you clown all, the, all the votes from everybody. So what is the fun house exactly, since we have you live right now, we're recording this. It's my house! So then yeah, why don't Chatterbox you have control like, of your own house? I don't understand. But what he means, Chatterbox, Chatterbox, is what does the fun house like mean to you? Like, why, yeah, what's, why, yeah, like, what does it mean to you as a person? It's more than just your house, you know? It's, it's everything. Place, right? It's where I grew up. It's all I know. It's everything. It's been passed down into the... It's been the clown family for generations. Okay, and why... Who grabbed... Like, what happened to it? Like, who stole it from you? Well, I, when Bobo died, I couldn't pay for it. And Grandma's yucked up. She can't walk. She's in a wheelchair. Wow, so that's she couldn't sad. pay for it. So they commandeered yeah. it. So I just squatted it. Really? That's I'm so $3 sad. million dollars in debt. What? That's so $3 million? Nice, though. That's $3 a thing. $3 million, dollars, yep. That's so sad. We're literally going to get pulled over again for what? The... Yep, there's your bill. Yeah, absolutely. Hey, Thank that, you so much. Thank you for you. See, see, how you doing, my friend? Hey, Both for being free. Vote for me. Vote for me. Is this traffic stop over with or are we free to go? Oh, fuck it. Uh, That's about it for this week, folks. In conclusion, I'd like to say that on behalf of the Cuban National Federation for the unification of Los Santos and the greater state of San Andreas, there's only one horse worth backing in this race, and that's Commander Osvaldo Pingafria and the Cuban National Federales. Thank you and good night, Los Santos.